Hello and welcome to Royal Vibes. Prince Harry is looking to position himself as the rebel royal through his highly anticipated new memoir, Royal Branding Expert as told Express.co.uk. So guys, before we get right into that story, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please make sure to hit the subscribe button, give the video a like, and please make sure to watch it right up to the very end. The Duke of Sussex is set to release a woefully truthful memoir of his life at some point this year. The book had been tentatively tabled for his autumn, although various reports have contradicted the timeline for its release. Published by Penguin Random House, it is ghost written by um, Pulitzer Prize winning J.R. Moringa. Prince Harry said he was deeply grateful for the opportunity to share what I have learned over the course of my life so far and excited for people to read a first-hand account of my life that's accurate and wholly truthful. The act of committing a memoir to paper, however, speaks volumes in itself about how Prince Harry is looking to contradict the traditional strictures, uh, the structures placed on members of the royal family, a royal branding expert has said. Professor Pauline McLaren of Royal Holloway, University of London, described how Prince Harry's upcoming publication would likely feed into the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's David vs. Goliath narratives. She told Express.co.uk that I think Prince Harry will be looking to position himself as the rebel royal, a rebel with a cause as it were. Rebel brands a challenge, you know, rebel brands challenge the mainstream, in this case, the traditional strictures placed on members of the royal family and gain support from their David versus Goliath narratives. So Harry is likely to suggest he is a victim of the royal system and now he is fighting for his freedom, etc. This time of approach will sit comfortably with Meghan's podcast series that also has rebel connotations. Earlier this week, the Duchess of Sussex released the first episode of a new Spotify podcast called Archetypes. The collaboration with the streaming giant was announced back in 2020. You know, it um, of course came shortly after the Duke and Duchess of Sussex stepped back from royal family duties in March of that year. The podcast will dissect the labels that try to hold women back, featuring celebrity guests and expert interviews. In a teaser clip, Megan added that I've had conversations with women who know all too well how these typecasts shape our narratives. You know, the Duchess of Sussex said she wanted the podcast to rip apart the boxes women have been placed into for generations. She continued by saying, and I'll talk to historians to understand how we even got here in the first place. The first episode featured the Duchess's longtime friend and legendary tennis player Serena Williams. The pair discussed motherhood, pregnancy, and ambition during the pilot episode. The next installment is set to feature singer Maria Carey. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex's unofficial biographer by name Omid Scobby also announced earlier this month that a sequel to Finding Freedom was in the works. The follow-up to the bestseller will be released on as yet unspecified dates next year. Um, Harper Collins published a book in the UK, said the new release will have the world taken about a new chapter of the royal story that will feature unique insight, deep access, and exclusive revelations. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.